Welcome to our review of entering employee expense receipts and reimbursement requests in Acumatica. I'll begin by going to my favorites bar here and we'll see I'm going to focus on the expense receipts and then submitting the claims. For an expense receipt, you can do that from your desktop or laptop by just going in here, selecting what you want to do. This is going to be office supplies and maybe at this point I had to go buy a notepad and I want to charge, let's just say, $8 for the notepad. And instead of charging it on my corporate card, I paid for it personally. At the same time, while you're doing your entry, you'll notice you can actually put in your customer, regard an activity directly related to the customer, make it billable. You can add your project codes and field service items. Now that you have it in there, I'm just going to go ahead and save that. Go grab my receipt that I've already stored to my desktop place it here and able to move on or claim it. But if you're traveling, sometimes waiting till you get back, stuffing all those receipts, I never liked doing that, having to remember where they were and then get them into my system when I got home. So instead, I prefer using the mobile app. By using my phone, it's much easier to get things done while you're traveling. If you just bring up your mobile device, you'll notice I've got it saved to my favorites. I'll have to use my finger on my phone to move around on here, but I'm going to try and point to where I'm at. For instance, right now, I just want to enter a receipt. I could click on receipts, and just like you saw before, going to the plus button at the bottom, I can type everything in just like you saw over here. Description, item, billable, and so on. But I'm going to cancel that. We're going to go back to the main screen of my entering receipts on my favorites, and I'm going to use this ellipsis on the right. I could have done it from the expense receipts form, but to show how easy it is, I can just say capture an expense receipt. I can go ahead and enter screen, bring up my expense receipt, snap a picture of it, and you'll notice here that by snapping the picture, it recognized the description, the dollar amount, Everything's filled in the date. The only thing it didn't pick up is the expense item. So I'm just going to open that up and say that was my dinner and add that to it and go ahead and save. If I have another receipt to enter, I can do the exact same thing. Let's just go ahead and add, uh, capture another expense here and say done. Again, you'll notice here it brought in the date, the invoice amount, dollar amount. The only thing, again, since it hasn't recognized this as a business in air travel, I need to add that. But Acumatica begins to use its AI capability. When it recognizes the same description, it begins to fill in your expense item for you so you have everything done. And in both of these cases, I charged it to my company credit card, which I've left as my default, so I'm just going to hit save. The other thing just quickly I'll mention is that whenever you're doing your invoices and you're printing them out, sometimes you've received your invoices electronically. So if you go to capture an expense, if I hit this little icon on the bottom right, it brings up my camera photos. You can just take a picture directly from the receipt online, add it here, and in the same way, add your receipts from your electronic receipts while you're traveling. So I've been on the road. I've entered all my expenses through my expense receipts. I'm going to go back to favorites and go to expense claims. At the end of the week, month, however often you do it, you can go in, add your receipts, and it automatically brings up the three that we just entered. I can select to put them all on one receipt or one claim or separate them if I have differences, maybe for different times and dates. I've been holding this for a while. Once I add and close that, I'm going to go ahead and save it. I need a description. This is for my Atlanta trip, so I'll just type that in here, hit save, and then I can submit. Next thing is that goes off to the approval process where your approver can approve the claim and get sent to accounts payable. I'll go ahead and do it right here and release it. Once those are done, we'll just go take a quick look at bills and payments. And you'll see here's the trip, the Atlanta trip, Maxwell Baker in here waiting for payment of the one item that I purchased out of personal cash. The rest will be associated with the credit card when that receipt comes in. That's it for how you enter your receipts and how you submit your expense claims. For any further information, be sure to contact us at aswiUS.com.